Chuka, you are all business right now. Final face-off with Cheeto is over. What's going through your mind? Just excited to perform. You know, had a great camp, had a long camp, and uh, I'm just truly excited and grateful to be able to perform in, in this audience or in front of this audience. You mentioned camp. The last camp that you had, you were dealing with an injury, just making sure you could get to the fight. Knowing you're coming into this one fully healthy, what type of confidence does that give to you and your ability to fight wherever you want for 25 minutes? Yeah, never a lack of confidence when you have this bad boy with you. But, uh, you know, it's, it feels great. Obviously, you'd rather go into a fight feeling healthy than compromised. So, yeah, very excited. Talk to me about the first couple of minutes of this fight and what that might look like, particularly because Cheeto sometimes can be a slower starter. I guess you'll have to tune in and find out. <laughs> okay, we will do that. Sean, what else can we look forward to from your first title defense with this bantamweight belt? You know, every time I step in there, something exciting happens. Uh, you know, expect nothing less. As you prepare for this one, it is Friday night here as we do this interview. What does the next 24 hours or so look like for you as you prepare to get into that octagon with Cheeto once again? A lot of waiting around, a lot of laying around, a lot of stretching, um, you know, not a whole lot. It's a waiting game. Saturday feels like the longest day ever. Um, I mean, we're pretty much fighting Sunday morning at, the, at that yeah. point. So, uh, you know, it's a very, very long day of waiting around, a lot of sleeping, a lot of chilling. You do a lot of mental work. What's the vision here? What, what are you manifesting? What are you envisioning for yourself in your performance? You know, I keep seeing the... When I close my eyes, I keep seeing the ref just pulling me off, begging me to stop beating on his forehead, so... Pretty much that. Any prediction of what round we might see that in? Uh, I've been hearing a lot of third rounders, you know. I don't know. That's just what the people have been telling me. But, you know, I, I just go in there, go with the flow. Whatever happens, happens. Um, yeah. Before I let you go, how I know that you guys have had history. I know that sometimes there's beef. Things get heated. How do you maintain the right composure that you need to perform your best? Um, I just know what state of mind I need to be in, and that's a calm state of mind to perform at my highest uh, level. So anything else is just, you know, n not helping me. So, you know, I'm going to come in as, as calm as ever and, and do what I do. Excellent. Well, we can't wait to see it. Sugar, good luck to you.